Hey everybody, David and David here from payitforward.com and upphone.com and in this video we're going to show you how to split screen on your iPad. Pretty amazing what your iPad could do nowadays. Back in the day you could only have one app open at a time, but now in America you've got two cars in every garage, so why not have two apps side by side on your iPad too? Yes. How do we do it, David? So first, we're gonna go into the settings app to make sure a few things are turned on. These are on by default, but it doesn't hurt to check. If yep. you know you saw her watching this video and it's not working, it's probably because these settings are off. So I'm gonna open the settings app, tap on home screen and dock, tap on multitasking, and just make sure these three switches are on. A lot of multiple apps, picture in picture and gestures. So there's a couple things we need to know before we get started. Sure. A few different uh, terms. One is the split view, so that's the side-by-side -side apps. Another one is slide over, mm -hmm. which is gonna make a little app. And the third piece is the dock. So that just appears at the bottom of the screen. Yep. You can slide up from the bottom with your finger and the dock will appear. There it is. There it is. Let's go back to the home screen, David, right. and I'll let you take over and demo all of these cool features for us. Yes, yeah, so I'm gonna press the home button, go back to the home screen. Great. So let's say, use case, we're working, watching the Apple event. We wanna communicate with our team while we're watching that event. Uh, but I don't have to switch back and forth to do it. Simple enough. What do we do? So I'm going to open Safari. Just, there's the Apple event all queued up. I'm going to open the dock by swiping up from the very bottom of the screen. And then I'm going to press and hold on the Skype icon and just drag it over. How about that? Pretty cool. All right. So right now we've got Safari on one side and we've got Skype on the other side. And this is split view. Yes. You could have put Skype into slide over mode though, mm -hmm. right? Yes. So let's show them how to do that. The difference between split view and slide over. Sure. This is split view. Because David pressed and held down on the app and then dragged it off the dock, that's how you always have to start this, whether it's doing the slide over, which is kind of like the mini version of the app or the whole split screen. He held it up and it dragged it over to the right side of the screen. The screen kind of splits and then drop it there. Now you could put one of these apps into slide over mode just by swiping down from the top of the app. So let's go ahead and try that. Here we go. Let's let go. Perfect. There we are. So now we've got a full screen Safari in the background and we've got Skype in the foreground. Yes. Now, what if you wanted to have three apps on the screen at once? Got to get our split view on there. Right. So first we got to put one of these back into split view. All right. We got to have split view and then you have to do the slide over. Right. So let's just drag down and Stick it back there, there perfect. Now you can open the dock again. It's the same process, except you don't drag the app over to the right or left side. You just sort of let it go in the middle of the screen. So I'll take the app store, just drag it up to the middle of the screen here. Yep, drop it. Bang. Three apps. Three apps at once. How Amazing. Many apps, how many apps can you put on there? Just three is the answer. Yeah, one other thing I'd like to demo real quick if I can. Oh, all right, well, that's fine. You can also change, you know, if you want the YouTube to be bigger than the Skype, for example, you can just start dragging it over a little bit and you, know, you don't need a lot of room for your messenger. You can... <laughs> That's pretty awesome, isn't it? Yeah. And you're probably also sitting there thinking, well, those aren't the apps that I want. I want different apps in my dock, but they're not there. <laughs> we probably should just show you how to add different apps to your dock. It's pretty easy. Mm -hmm. uh, press and hold on the ad you'd like to add to your dock. Let's do news, edit home screen, and just drag it right on down. Now it's in the dock. Boom. So to use this for any apps, stick them in your dock. Yep. Otherwise, it's not gonna work. So that's how to split screen on your iPad. One thing we didn't demo here is picture in picture. Check out our other video, link in the card above and description section below, walking you through picture in picture. It's a really cool new feature. Yep, great feature. Same process on iPad as it is on iPhone. Yes, thanks for watching this video. Give it a thumbs up if you enjoyed. Leave a comment down below with any other questions and don't forget to subscribe to this channel for more great iPad videos.